they found these five men from 30 years earlier. And they measured their cardiorespiratory fitness and a variety of other parameters that they had measured at the time. And what they found was that three weeks of bed rest was worse on their cardiorespiratory fitness than 30 years of aging. So essentially, their cardiorespiratory fitness was no worse 30 years later than it was after their three weeks of bed rest, which is kind of amazing because you would think that the 30 years of aging would be worse on your cardiorespiratory fitness than the three weeks of bed rest. And it's the same, the same individuals. The same individuals, the same five men. Um, now, after the three weeks of bed rest, you know, back, back in the 1960s, they were able to get their cardiorespiratory fitness back up again once they started exercising and moving around, and it took a while. But when you look at their baseline levels, their baseline cardiorespiratory fitness, and you compare it to their cardiorespiratory fitness baseline 30 years later, it wasn't worse than what happened when they, they compared it to the three weeks of bed rest. 